Hello, I'm Yuka from TheLoneGamers.com. Today I'll be walking you through the new ship fitting tool that was added with Star Citizens Alpha 2.1. As you can see, there were a few improvements to usability and readability, as well as a few changes to functionality. The fonts were changed to make readability better. Additionally, there was also a filtering system added to make it easy to view parts in various ways. The filtering system is controlled by this pane on the bottom left hand corner. There are five filters that can be applied currently. The first filter in default is equipable. This filter shows you all parts that are currently compatible with the ship that you have selected. Equipped current is the second filter and shows parts that are currently equipped. Equipped other apparently has no function right now or is not compatible with any of the ships that I own. Unequipable are parts that are not compatible with the ship that you have selected. And the last filter shows all parts that are available in, re in your inventory on the tab that you're on. It should be noted that rental parts no longer show up with the magenta color and equipped parts are a deep pur purple in color. Now I want to attach a badger repeater to this front slot on my Hornet. In order to do that, I'm going to flip my filter over to the equipable tab. I'm going to locate my size 3 gimbal and I'm going to attach it to the front slot. Now I'm going to locate my badger repeater and I'm going to attach it to the front slot as well. And that's it. It should also be noted that weapon systems now show stats on the left hand pane that are actually useful. One of the great strengths of this new system is the ability to remove items, especially when dealing with, with missiles. In the past, you'd have to find the missile in the rack and pull it off, one for each, each slot in the rack, which could be troublesome when you have eight slots uh, such as on the Hornet. But now, all I need to do is flip over to equipped current and I see that I have the Spark 1 missile in my racks. Instead of having to find them in the rack, all I do is click and drag just a little bit and it removes it. As you can see, a slot opened up. Since I have 8 slots, I need to do this 7 more times. Since all the missiles are now gone, my right hand list is now empty. I'm going to flip my filter back over to Equipable, locate my Marksman, and add them to the rack. My racks are full. Unequipable or incompatible weapon systems also show up as in red, as you can see the Dominator 2, which is not compatible with my Hornet weapon rack. That wraps up this guide. I hope you found it informational. If you have comments, please leave them on the video or look at the video info and go to the link there and add them to the article on thelonegamers.com. Thank you for watching.